Welcome back to Ozarks Live. Taco de Somo is coming this weekend, and here with all the details is Casey Allen of Nacho Ordinary Taco. Hello. I love the name of that. <laughs> Thank you. Tell us about your truck, first of all. Well, we've been uh, operating for about 10 years. Uh, we started in Bolivar, Missouri, in kind of smaller communities, mm -hmm. worked our way to Springfield. Um, we've uh, sold tacos at a number of different uh, music festivals across mm -hmm. the country. Um, we've we hit the breweries here in town. Uh, we hit any kind of local uh, manufacturing plans yeah. for lunch. What um, makes you not so ordinary or not so <laughs> ordinary? Well, we try to take chef-inspired recipes and okay. basically turn them into tacos. Wow. A lot of times, you know, you think about a typical taco, it's usually the same thing. Mm -hmm. We're trying to break those boundaries mm -hmm. and okay. push it to that yeah. extra edge. Like, give me an example. I was just gonna say um, yeah. We have like, a, I'd say probably one of our most popular uh, tacos. We do a Hawaiian surf and turf. It's just uh, a teriyaki, teriyaki glazed shrimp and steak, uh, lettuce, pineapple chutney, and a spicy aioli. And then we have a signature thing we do to our tortillas. Uh, I'm gonna tell everybody this <laughs> maybe not be a secret as much. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But we we take a little bit of butter and then we uh, put Parmesan on our tortillas Ooh. and then we crust it on the flat top and it gives it that crust. That yeah. uh, salty crust yeah. to the I'm tortilla. All in on yeah, that. that sounds really <laughs> good. Yes, yes. Yeah. So you're here because Taco de Somos sure. this weekend. So explain to everyone what the concept of that is. Um, it's basically a taco chef competition. We've done it the last two years. We won People's Choice uh, the last two years, mm -hmm. and I was able to uh, get a golden ticket to go to yeah. Dallas and participate in the World Food Championship hmm. uh, down there as a chef competitor. Yeah. And this is kind of the same thing, okay. but a little bit local, you yeah, know. Yeah, yeah. Are people here competing then to go to Dallas? Yes, this, okay. uh, there's four of us chefs that are gonna be competing this round. Um, there's also gonna be food trucks. I'll have my food truck selling $2 tacos okay. um, out of the truck. Yeah. So we'll kind of be doing double duty. Sure. Um, but as far as the, the competition, uh, it's we have an hour to cook. Um, uh, I thought that the uh, category was bacon. That's what we kind of participated at the World Food Championship. Um, so we're gonna go ahead and uh, do a bacon dish. Okay. And we're awesome. excited to show everybody because yeah. I got a cool yeah. idea. That so. sounds really cool. Okay. Now, how would you say the competition or the experience of it all compares here locally to that World Champ in Dallas? Um, honestly, here was, I mean, there was a lot of pressure I felt sure. in Dallas, but then when I actually did it, it really wasn't all that Big, I mean, it's it's a big deal, big deal but, but it wasn't that yeah, it wasn't yeah. that bad. Here, I feel like it's just more engagement with the audience. Okay. Everybody that attends seems to uh, really, you know, they'll cheer you on. They're 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 checking out what you're doing, how you're preparing your dish. Um, I think the just the crowd engagement's a little bit more okay. here locally. Now, are all four of you professional cooks? I think one of them. I I, I think. One of them's like a private chef. Okay. Uh, Kimberly, she's actually uh, one of the chefs that uh, I participated in the World Food Championship with down in Dallas. And uh, what's cool about it, we the the contacts I've been able to uh, get out of doing this competition mm -hmm. are pretty much priceless. That's sure, incredible. that makes sense. Yeah. So yeah. and she she'll be one of the chefs, and then uh, a lady that just was on Gordon Ramsay's show. Oh. oh. Sarah, uh, Sarah Fry. Fry. Yeah. She, she'll be participating. Okay. And then there was a, another gentleman that's like a private chef. I'm not sure about yeah. him, and, but I'm excited to meet him all. And yes. Billy Dove is, oh, is uh, yep. judging. That's awesome. Billy will be there. <laughs> yep, <laughs> we do. <laughs> Sounds good. All right, final question. Sure. Is there some kind of partnership we understand with the Developmental Center of the Ozarks with this? Yes, yes. Uh, Robin and her team, they do a great job of raising money for this thing. Um, I'm not sure the ins and outs and yeah. what they exactly where the money goes from, but I know all the proceeds are going to yeah. help the development. Very cool. That's yes. incredible. And yes. people can come watch. How do we get tickets to that? Absolutely. Uh, there's. Do do I think there's the website. There's two tiers of tickets. Okay. okay. Uh, there's. I think there might be 200 tickets for the chef competition. So get them fast because those things will probably sell yes. out. And then there's also some tickets to get into the other festivities. There's like a Chihuahua. Uh, <laughs> oh, that's <pageant>. fun! <laughs> I have a Chihuahua. His oh, name's cool. Petey Pablo. And Petey Pablo. We thought about bringing him. I don't know if I can do three things at yeah. once. So, uh, but he yeah. might make an appearance. He may, so we'll he, see. Petey Pablo yes. might be there with yes. my son. My son's here to, today, and yeah. uh, mm -hmm. I th I told him he might have to. Walk P.D. Pablo That's down amazing. the yes. red yes. carpet. So, so all the information we need about all of that is on the, the website. TacoDeSomo.com. Right. Okay. Perfect. Perfect. Casey, thank you so much. Absolutely. Good luck this Thanks. weekend. Thank We're you, guys. For you. Good to meet you.